Shipping with FedEx in T-Hub is easy. On the order processing screen, you select the orders you want to ship. You can select one order or multiple orders with your control and shift keys down. And then click on this ship with FedEx icon on top. This will open up the ship with FedEx screen in T-Hub with the orders you selected. On this screen, you can change the shipment details for each shipment for each package before you generate the FedEx labels. So you can select one order at a time and review the weight and change the weight if you want to. You can change the dimensions. You can select other settings like residential flag or if you need to have signature required, you can set that. You move to the next shipment on top and do the same, review the weight, change the weight if you have to. And once you're done, you click on get rates. So this connects with your FedEx account and gives you the FedEx rates for all the available services for your selected shipment and the address details that you have selected. Uh, so you can choose for the first shipment, let's say we choose FedEx ground and for the second we choose FedEx two day uh, shipment. Uh, once you've selected the shipping services for each uh, selected shipment, you can click on generate label. This goes to FedEx and generates the actual FedEx labels that you can put on the box. Uh, click yes when it's ready. So T Hub generated two FedEx labels. One was FedEx ground and the other was FedEx today. You can then send the labels to the printer and it gets printed right away. In this demo, I've set up my printer as a PDF so it comes on the screen, but you can send the labels directly to your printer for printing. And the printer can be a regular laser printer or it can be printed to thermal printer. So that completes the shipping of orders in FedEx. You can go into the order detail by double clicking on the order and you will see the tracking number in T-Hub. And if you want to void the shipment, you can void it right from here. Or if you want to generate a return label, you can click on the return label, return icon here to generate a return label.